from this stock. How are you, Tulsi Manjiri? Who else is drawing? Suraj. Oh, Suraj. Very nice to have you, Suraj. You're grown up now. You're graduated and came to Madhava, right? Aren't you? Suraj. One minute, Mataji. Give him a minute or two because uh, after school he was just napping, so I will wake him up. Oh, then how, what time again he will go back, Mataji, to sleep and then it, it won't be difficult for him to it's uh, 5 uh, 515 5, 519 right now so for us it is okay you have a lot of time for us mm -hmm. okay. nice mataji nice to see uh, suraj in uh, madhava class so we'll start the class with the prayers suraj also will be joining us soon okay i want everybody to be unmuted tulsi manjiri please unmute yourself and start the prayers with me Vrinda. Can you also do prayers with me, please? Yes. Oh, Magnana, Tima, Dasya, Jena, Shela, Kriya, Chakshurum, Militam, Yena, Tasmai, Shri, Guru, Vena, Maha, Namo, Vishnu, Padaya, Krishna, Kastaya, Bhutale, Shrimate Bhakti Vedanta Swami Niti Namine Namaste Saraswati Deve Gauravani Pacharike Nidesha Shunyavadi Pashya Chandesha Thakine Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Okay, let's all chant uh, 21 uh, times Hare Krishna Mahamantra. Uh, one person will be chanting on unmute. I, I request Smriti or Tulsi Manjari. Any one of you can go to chant louder uh, Hare Krishna and everybody else will chant on mute. Who wants to go? Mantaji, could I go? Yes, yes, Smriti, go ahead. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Dam, 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 Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, 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 Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram. Ram Ram Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare 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 Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Thank you, Smriti. That was wonderful chanting and chanting with you make me very happy. Moving on to the revision part. Last week, what sloka we learned? Is anybody remember that sloka? Yes, Mataji. 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 Yes,
what mataji has taught you all smriti did you remember this sloka what mataji taught you yes mataji isn't this the one that's on the screen the same thing do you know the sloka recitation of it and translation can you do that to me yes mataji yajante satvika deva ट्राई तुलसी मंजरी डू यू वॉन्ट टू ट्राई लेट्स मूव टू बालवृंद बालवृंदेशन य Then, in the mood of goodness, worship the demigods. Those in the mood of passion, worship the the of demons. And those in the mood of ignorance, worship ghosts and spirits. Mm, very nice. Thank you. Is there anybody who would like to recite for me this verse? Mukund has joined. Mukund, would you like to recite last week's verse? Okay, Tulsi Manjari, go ahead. Yajante Satvika Devan Yaksha Raksham Si Rajasa Pratan Bhuta Ganam Shanye Yajante Tamasa Jana. Thank you. Would you like to recite the translation? It's very important for us to know the translation. That's why I'm asking everybody to recite it. Can you read it for me, please? Okay, ma'am. Men in the mode of goodness worship the demigods. Those in the mode of passion worship the demons, and those in the mode of ignorance worship ghosts and spirits. Mm, very nice. Thank you, Dulce Manjula. Thank you. Now, uh, Kabir Mukund. Okay, Kabir and Mukund, one more time. Would you like to do it? Okay, I think Mukund has lost his connection. Okay, we'll let him come back. Today's verse. Today's verse. We are seeing seventeen point sixteen. Let's recite each line three times. Mana prasada somyatvam. 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 मौनमात्मा तपो मानस मुच्यते 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 ओके टू लाइंस टुगेदर आई एम ट्राइंग टू डिसाइड मन प्रसाद सौम्यत्वम मौन आत्मा विनिग्रह मन प्रसाद 
मन प्रसाद सौम्य मौनमात्मा विग्रह मन प्रसाद सौम्य मौनमात्मा विग्रह मन प्रसाद सौम्य मौनमात्मा विग्रह प्रसाद सौम्य मौनात्मा विग्रह सिद्धिपो मनस मुच्यते तपो 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 मनस मुच्यते वंडरफुल now everybody can take turn to recite this shloka so that way we will at least three people okay suraj go ahead are you there suraj yes mata ji go ahead uh, mana prasad samyat ma uh, yam mana ma atma vinigraha pava samsundir e तापो समम वंडरफुल सूरज वंडरफुल ओके नेक्स्ट वी हैव तुलसी मंजरी रेशन गो हेड तुलसी मंजरी मन प्रसाद सौम्य मौन आत्मा विग्रह भाव संशोधित तपो मनस मुच्यते वंडरफुल तुलसी मंजरी आई फील लाइक डांसिंग विथ यू ओके स्मृति गो हेड मन प्रसाद मन प्रसाद सौम्य मौन आत्मा विग्रह भाव संपो मनस मुच्यते भाव स्मृति दट इज वेरी इजी राइट वेरी इजी श्लोक this we by reciting three times we got it are we did we all got it yes mata ji wonderful who is that bhakti sangha mana prasad samyatram maunam atmani vinigraha bhava samshukti rithye tat tapo manas mukshate thank you vidhi vilas ni mata ji thank you so much Okay. Now, what's the translation? Who would like to read the translation for me? Okay, Smriti, go ahead and read the translation. Thank you, Mother. Um, and satisfaction, simplicity, gravity, self-control, and purification of one's existence are the austerities of the mind. Thank you, Mother. Wonderful. so we are seeing some qualities right so those qualities if you have that means that we are doing some austerities to the mind that means we are trying to work on our mind our mind is like a wind it just goes here and there when we try to control that mind that is called austerity and how we can control that mind and when the mind is controlled what kind of qualities we develop that we are going to see in this verse so first one is gravity in thoughts so that is what we are going to discuss is there anybody would like to read this paragraph for me advait anybody who did not get a chance to read before mata you can advait go go ahead advait okay the best training for the mind is gravity in thought one should not deviate from krishna consciousness and always is avoid sense gratification to purify one's nature is to become krishna conscious thank you mata ji thank you advait that was wonderful what is gravitational force can anybody explain me you all are very good science students right you all know better me better than me what is gravitational force nobody 
मैथेचे ग्रेविटेशनल फोर्स इस दे अम इस द फोर्स एंड मूव अम दैट अम मूव्स इस डाउन सो दैट वी डोंट कीप फ्लोटिंग इन द एयर या यस राइट सो दैट इस व्हाट कॉल्ड ग्रेविटेशनल फोर्स सो देन व्हाट इस कृष्णा कॉन्शियस ग्रेविटेशनल माइंड मींस व्हाट इस दैट मींस so the mind usually tend to go here and there everywhere right i just want to smell the very very nice smell very nice aroma away from it's coming i just want to see this i just want to see that cartoon movie right we keep on thinking on uh, all these objects sense objects oh i just want to taste this i just want to uh, hear this i just wanted to touch this it's all like mind is going everywhere so when what happens mind is not in a control right how do we get into control that too by practicing krishna consciousness like we have a nice example of shila prabhupad shila prabhupad came from india to western world right when he came to western world there is so much of sense gratification around him right he could have nicely enjoyed everything but then what did he do did he enjoy shila prabhupad came here to enjoy no no right yeah so that is a, a gravity a gravity mind gravity mind is means like we um, uh, we are trying to control the mind of uh, by practicing krishna consciousness shila prabhupad was never behind all of this sense gratification which is around here but he was always trying to be krishna consciousness not only that he was krishna consciousness he was giving krishna consciousness to everyone around around him right he made everyone krishna consciousness he he made is con to be spreaded to all over the world right so can anybody read this quote here here in in this not taken advaitir yes however every hammer 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 every thought in your mind thinking of how to serve krishna mathi yeah. last year i put this in my this quote in my um in my uh, presentation oh okay i don't remember okay okay yes see how do we can how do we control our mind oh, by yeah. all the thoughts of krishna consciousness in our mind so that way we are not deviated we are not getting attracted to the sense sense gratification when we don't get this attraction for the sense gratification that way we can always concentrate on krishna how can we do by practicing every day by chanting hari krishna maha mantra by following the four regulatory principles by associating with the devotees that way we can always connect to krishna and we all the sense objects can uh, can be concentrated on krishna instead of other things right so that way we are not stopping the sense objects to be silent but we are using them for krishna consciousness i smell tulsi leaf i see krishna i taste nice prasadam i hear about krishna right that way we are engaging our senses in a proper way and we are also making our mind to engage in krishna consciousness instead of other sense gratification like how shila prabhupad ta taught us to do moving on to the next quality um satisfaction of the mind how we can how we can get this satisfaction of the mind anybody else can read this mathi ji can i read this is no con yes go ahead. okay mathi ji satisfaction of the mind can be obtained only by taking the mind away from thoughts of sense enjoyment the more we think of sense enjoyment the more the mind becomes dissatisfied In the present age, we unnecessarily engage the mind in so many different ways for sense gratification, and so there is no possibility of the mind becoming satisfied. The best course is to divert the mind to the Vedic literature, which is full of satisfying stories, as in the Puranas and the Mahabharata. One can take advantage of this knowledge and thus become purified. Very nice. Very nice. so here how can we get satisfaction in the mind by pra by participating in krishna consciousness by engaging these senses in krishna consciousness what is the sense gratification sense gratification is like itching you keep uh, how what is the problem of itching right when you get itch you itch and then what happens the blood will come out of from the place where you are itching even though it is giving some satisfaction when you are itching you feel that 
it, you feel like relaxation but then what's happening there is pus coming out of from there and blood coming out of from there when rinda was very small she had this lot of eczema problem she used to keep itching 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 and then uh, at the morning when she wakes up it's all blood on her face yes when she eats she feels satisfied but then what's the result the blood is coming out so sense gratification is also like that when we try to satisfy our senses by doing all this um, unnecessary activities okay today i might feel happy by watching a movie or by going out and eating in a restaurant but then later it's going to trouble me it's not going to be satisfied one day two day th third day fourth day fifth day i feel bore about it and i also feel distress why am i doing this repeatedly there is no satisfaction but we as a soul we should connect to krishna where if you are not connecting to krishna there is no scope of satisfaction in within us there is no scope because the real satisfaction is serving krishna and um, there is a uh, this story of yayati in shrimad bhagavatam uh, th this yayati he wants to become very young like his son, like his son's age and he wanted to enjoy everything but at the end of the day what happened he was not able to uh, he was not able to feel any happy he he then later renounced everything and left everything he understood that this is not the uh, aim of the life so the sense gratification is like that then how can we control our mind uh, to not to divert from the sense uh, sense gratification um, not to go towards the sense gratification or how to make our mind satisfy to do something which is krishna conscious yes how can be mind satisfied that that is only through the vedas that's when the mind is satisfied not only for us for everybody in human kind everyone get get satisfied by uh, doing by reading this puranas how um, even uh, you you see that parikshit maharaj right he was uh, having this uh, hearing krishna katha for seven days seven nights without eating um, uh, without uh, eating sleeping and everything nothing right he was just he was just uh, hearing keep hearing 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 krishna katha he was not saying i am hunger he was not saying i am thirsty he is full of satisfied right one second he is full satisfied so that is what the krishna katha makes that is what the puranas the mahabharata all of this will help us to be satisfied in uh, satisfied of mind okay that's how the main satisfaction comes not through uh, sense gratification today we might do it tomorrow we feel again again uh, problem again we feel dissatisfied L the law of diminishing marginal utility i remember from the school days that uh, when i studied economics So it's like that sense gratification is like that. Uh, first, it will be too high. Oh, I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying. Towards the end, you will drop the interest for it because there is no pressure. There is no pleasure. That happiness, that real satisfaction, is not there for us when you do sense gratification. But when you do Krishna Katha, when you hear Krishna Katha, that satisfaction is there for us. So that's how we can satisfy our mind. the next one can anybody read this one for me mata ji can tell us read mata ji can tell us read yes yes go ahead the mind should be devoid of duplicity and one should think of the welfare of all silence means that one's Uh, that one is always thinking of self realization yes very nice very nice what is it saying duplicity right what is called duplicity can anyone explain last time i think this uh, and how do i favored motam reply me comes smriti answered very nicely to lalitangi mata ji do you want to explain smriti what is duplicity means Mind. Your volume is very low. Can you come closer a little bit? Mother, can you hear me? Yes, but then it's low. Then continue, continue. Um, okay. 
Now can you hear me, Mataji? Yes, go ahead. Okay, Mataji. So uh, one should not always think that they are on the top of the world and that they're always um, they're going to be the best. And, so, uh, and the duplicity means that um, one, uh, one should um, always think like they should not say one thing to someone and saying, oh, I think you're very good. But then really they're throwing insults to them on their back. Just in the mind, they're throwing insults, but to them, they're saying, Oh, very good, very good. You've done a very good job. Like in that picture, just Dupli and Siti, and that man, he's he, uh, in the, in the, uh, he has two, the two heads, and in one side, he's saying good job, and the other side, he's throwing insults. Okay. Yes, that is correct, Smithy. Thank you so much for saying double mind, right? In front of everybody, oh, you're so sweet, you're so nice, and then go back and you say something else. So that is called duplicity. And that, if you if you don't have that, that is called simplicity. That we can only achieve by practicing Krishna consciousness. In Krishna consciousness, we are being taught that not to offend any devotee, not to have any ill feeling to others, right? And also, there is one more thing to it. If sometimes we say that, like, you know, I, I wanted to share something and you, you listen to me, you'll become good. And I, I will tell uh, all these secrets. How do, you, how do you get nice scores in the class? But then what do you do? You don't tell everything and you just keep the secrets for you. And then you try to act like as if like you are helping the other person. But then you don't really help them. So that is also one kind of duplicity, right? You're... you're Try, for, force it in front of everyone that you are helping the other person, but then you are really not helping them. So the positive side of this is what is that? Is simplicity and having a um, love and care for others. And actually, they from the bottom of their heart they want to help someone. That is uh, done by who? The sages in Naima Serenia, right? They are all were doing a. a, a um, what they were doing? What they were doing? They were doing in Naima Serenia? The sacrifices, right? They were doing sacrifices. And then what happened? Sutta Goswami came and gave Bhagavatam. So that's how uh, the Bhagavatam is uh, helping to give everyone. Uh, helping everyone to get uh, rid of this, all the problems. And it is going to Help not only a single person, but everyone, right? That, that way, we will get happiness in our life. So simplicity means uh, spirituality. That And also that simplicity means not having any duplicity, not having any double-minded in our, in our thoughts. Okay, we are saying you're a good person, but at the same time, again, I'm thinking, oh, she's very bad, you know? That, that is not the one we, we are having here. A devotee is supposed to not have that. How can we not have that when we think that everybody is a part and parcel of Krishna? These teachings that Srila Prabhupada has given us make us uh, go higher in our thinking thoughts. And so that way we will be a good person and we can make others also to be a good person around us. Can anybody read this slide? Mataji, can I read it? Yes, sure. Go ahead. Control of the mind. The person in Krishna conscious observes perfect silence in this sense. Control of the mind means detaching the mind from sense enjoyment. One should be straightforward in his dealings and thereby, thereby purify his existence. Thank you, Mataji. Yeah. So how can we control our mind? Um, see, we see always these yogis, They what they do, they try to control the mind in a different way. They wanted to be silent. They wanted to uh, sit in posture and try to do some yoga and all this. Okay, let me be silent. Let me be controlled. I don't want it to involve in anything. Okay, then let's close my door and sit silently. Is it possible? It's not possible, right? If you ask me to sit for si close my eyes and sit for five minutes, I'll be slowly close opening my eyes and seeing what's happening around me. This is not possible. Here in Krishna consciousness, we say, Controlling the senses means it's not stopping the senses. It's diverting the senses to the other path. The, uh, actually, in this material world, everybody is trying to enjoy uh, the, uh, their senses in having a material thing. So then we say 
we don't go through the material side we try to be in a spiritual side we use all this material things but when we use it for the krishna service so that is called the uh, si um, perfect silence in krishna consciousness silence means not to speak or like control your senses not like that silence means to the sense gratification we are not going towards the material side we are only to the spiritual side we don't deal anything with the material okay if something is coming towards us okay we avoid them we don't try to uh, go and um, know about more things or disturb our mind disturb our uh, con krishna consciousness like here we see this this quote right working for krishna is the ultimate perfection of all the activities we are not stopping here any activities in our day to day life we are doing all the activities but we are keeping krishna in the center right like this person see here this person is eating everything that is coming around him is just enjoying everything is not thinking of anything is just wanted everything he want to eat meat he want to drink he want to do all those things um, and look at his face is very <laughs> ugly and look at this person as devotee he is also enjoying everything but then everything in krishna consciousness always having mind in krishna consciousness whatever we are doing but we are concentrating our mind only in krishna conscious thoughts who is the best example of that is the there is a picture in the slide can, who wants to say that you can see the picture on this slide who is the best example who always thinks about krishna prahlad maharaj was yes prahlad maharaj right prahlad maharaj was in so many difficulties so much of uh, difficulties he didn't ever shipu had put him in lot of troubles but then what he is always thinking is always chanting krishna's name so he knows that krishna is the only protector protector nobody else can protect him and when he was one pointed attention to only work towards krishna all the problems have run away right whatever situation look there were so many snakes around him and there is a fire around him uh, but still he was continuously thinking about krishna that way he would able to gain the love of krishna and he was able to solve all his problems on the path of um, krishna consciousness by constantly thinking about krishna right so this way all these qualities together when we when we do like when we control our mind when we when we try to be simple Uh, simple simplicity and everything all of this as in the translation says then that way we will become closer to krishna so can anybody read this one's uh, quote from by shila propat hare krishna mata ji can i me yes go ahead who feels humble and meek has the door for the kingdom of god open for him or her yeah when we have all those qualities and what happens then we get closer to krishna krishna is opening his doors for all of us and he's going to take us back to krish back to him so that's the today's verse we will just do one time translation and sloka and if there is any questions we can take Can anybody do the sloka once? Mata ji, can I see the sloka? Yes. Mana prasada samyatvam nauna madma vinigraha bhava samsudhirityat tapo mana samuchate. Thank you, Mata ji. Can you read the translation? Yes, Mata ji. and satisfaction simplicity gravity self control and purification of one's existence are the austerities of the mind thank you much thank you is there anybody having any doubts in this in this sloka okay today we did not have kahoot but then we can play this synonym game are you all ready to play or uh, what is the time now um For me, it's eight fifty-five. I think for me it's eight fifty-three, but I think for seven fifty-three. Okay, okay. We can just quickly play play this game one time, and then we can close the call. We can do one one shot and call. Okay. Okay. Austerity. What does austerity mean? Tapa. Tapa. Very nice. Shamshuddir. 
Mana prasadha. Satisfaction of the mind. Mind. Satisfaction of the mind. Yes. Baba. Of one's consolation. Consolation. Being without duplicity towards others. Saumyatma. Saumyatma means simplicity, right? Um, manaha. Manaha is not there. Okay. Maunam. Gravity. Gravity. Okay. Mm. Of the mind. Manasam. 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 Uchepe. Is said to be. Said to be. Mm, very nice. Okay. Thank you. So we will do Vancha Kalpa here. Uh, I don't know if you all understood this loka, but then definitely Mataji also will do the revision once before we go to the next verse. Okay, I would like to offer my obeisances. Vancha Kalpa Taru, Vyasya Kripa Sindhu, Vyavacha Patitanam, Pavanebhyo, Vaishnavi, Bhyo Namo Nama, Ananta Koti Vaishnav Rindu Ki Jai, Srila Prabhupada Ki Jai, All Ichil Madhava Ki Jai. Thank you everyone for joining today's class. Nice to have a session with you, all of you. Have a good night. Meet you on next Tuesday. Don't forget to join us. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Hare Krishna. Bye.